Hi friends, it's so nice to see you. We are continuing our Cave FRVR video series today, and it is worth noting that I am filming this mere minutes after I have finished uploading the last video. So at the moment, there have been no changes worth noting, but it is still nice to see you. I oftentimes do these weekend videos all over the course of the same day or maybe even the same hour so that way i can keep things going we just skip that little platform we're going to go ahead and land on this platform for the fuel and then you'll see the symbol that means that we skip the platform which is always nice we're going to go ahead and skip past this one and we're just going to keep it going um but yeah it is so nice to see everyone i hope that you all are doing well um as you can see we are doing we're doing all right, you know? Uh, not every time we're gonna have a tremendous amount of Ws. I was definitely flying a little too close to the sun, or rather, a little too close to the center of the earth, I guess. But we are still having a great time together. We're still chilling, so let's keep on going. Yeah, I very much enjoy creating videos. Uh, creating videos is decidedly my dream job. It, along with writing, are the things that I wanna do for the rest of my life. And I think that that would be the case even if I wasn't disabled and chronically ill. I ultimately want to be able to make a living and to be able to not have to worry about money, but I also want to do something that I love, and I definitely think that that's YouTube. I'm always so happy when I get to film videos, and in fact, over the course of the last couple of weeks, my attitude has taken on a noticeable shift. It's true that I definitely have not been doing quite as much writing as I used to and as I plan to in the future, but at the same time, the ability to have an audience and to engage with them in this especially fun way is something that I'm so fond of, and it's something that I'm so happy I can do every day while I am creating videos. I want to be able to interact with my friends and to create content that they can enjoy and that they can make a part of their lives, so it's so nice to be here with friends and to know that y'all are gonna say hi to me even when I get zapped into smithereens by lasers and that we're gonna be able to spend time together. Hey, we still got a chest, let's go! But yeah, right now my video is processing. By the time I finish recording this video, odds are the standard definition aspect of it will be completely re, um, will be completely done so that way people will be able to actually watch the video and it's gonna be nice to see how people react oh we completed a goal let's go uh so now we're able to do more things let's see we can go ahead and get our next little upgrade we are almost at the point that i was in as far as my next vehicle goes which is very exciting. Let's go ahead and see what little chest we get right now. Oh, we get a shield generator item, which is very nice. That's a little accessory that we can have. So that way we can have shields that are twice as durable slash two shields. I don't know a lot of the precise language that goes on in this particular game. I also don't really care to know. This is just something that I like to play while I am having these sorts of conversations with people. I'm planning to get back into live streaming fairly soon. It's just that, like, the time that would be the easiest for me to live stream is also when a lot of my friends are not able to do live streams. They're not able to come and visit, and I would like to do them anyway, but it's a little nerve-wracking. The thought of doing something like this, hey, we're able to get a bigger um, buff to our fuel, which is good, because that means that we could safely skip more places dang we don't have enough gems for this particular bonus that's fine um that means that we're able to skip more of these little platforms and also able to keep it going a little bit more dynamically i will skip this one although if i had known that i was going to be skipping it i probably should have just skipped it in advance here come some missiles we're going to dodge them pretty easily we're going to dodge these ones pretty easily and then we're just going to keep on falling you love to see it but I absolutely enjoy these particular videos. I think that it's a lot of fun to film these chill plays. I am just a really big fan of being able to record something in a few minutes as opposed to needing an especially long amount of time. 
because even my 15 minute long jump chain videos can still take upwards of an hour to film just because of takes and stuff like that. So it's nice to have something like this to fall back on. I also really enjoy the thought that I could have a whole bunch of these videos ready to go fairly fast. Um, curiously, I had a bunch of ideas for today's regular video that were not a chill stream, or rather yesterday's, by the time that this is gonna be uploaded and public, yesterday's chill stream video that were not what I ended up going with, which is a little bit disappointing. Um, I probably should have just gone with them. I had an idea to make a video on like jump chain ideas for people who wanted to do jump chains without doing self inserts and instead use fictional characters in an array of contexts, which was what I thought of originally doing. I had some big plans for that video and then I realized that that video was not gonna be easy to film and I would need to talk in not super significant detail, but in greater detail than I had planned, because those would be the sorts of ideas that I had for chains would be alt chains as opposed to being standard chains. And for the most part, my videos have focused on the idea that someone is going to have and be a part of standard chains as opposed to going and throwing the rules out the window. So I figured that it was a little bit too early for that particular video idea, even though Still a very big fan of that video. And I just ran out of fuel. Dang. Uh, that was a lot of fun. That was a very nice run. It ended up taking a good long while. And we got a chest. So I know that we did an absolutely bang up job on that one. Even if it ended in a rather unceremonious way. I, I realized that I lost all of my fuel at the very last second. And I was like, dang, I know that this is going to end badly. And I was correct. That was very funny. But yeah, it has been wild absolutely are actually making videos again because for such a long time, dang, all right, I need 13 gems. I'm going to try to get I'm going to try to get the 13 gems in this run so that way we can hit the third um vehicle, which is the vehicle I have in my main save file of this particular game. I've been playing a lot of this because this is a little bit more active than the like ball throwing game which is one of the other games that i play a lot and it doesn't require quite as much attention as the uh, first person shooter game which is also a game that someone could play on fr vr and i really like that game but it definitely requires more work than i am willing to put in while also making a video it'd be a very fun game to just play but it's not great to play while trying to film a video at the same time so that said we are now continuing to explore i'm really hoping that i have chances to grab some more uh of the purple pink gems to me those look pink although i think the intention is probably for them to be purple um, I don't know if that's just me being wonky when it comes to color. My eyes don't work very good, which is a little fun uh, canon Luciano fact for anyone who is curious to know more established Luciano lore. Um, but yeah, so we are keeping it going. We are still trying to hit what we need in this particular run. Oop, dang. Uh, and yeah. <laughs> oh, there's one of the little power icons. So these are very cool. With these, you can destroy things, and that definitely means that stuff is going to be real intense for a second. But it also means that there's a whole bunch of these beautiful gems. I'm going to skip the bonus this time, which is not something that I normally do. I normally like to save. I normally like to do the bonuses and risk stuff, but I don't want to risk... Uh, that is a, one that I should just go ahead and not get. Um, I don't want to risk stuff when I have this many needed gems. So I am playing it a little bit safe. But we are going to go ahead and when we lose this, we are going to go and have the upgraded vehicle. So that way people can see it. Uh, dang, I lost one of my... Oh no, I also lost my lasers shoot i don't know if those are actually the lasers or the proton torpedoes or whatever um but either way we lost them which is a bummer 
I'm gonna go ahead and do this and I'll play it a little bit risky, but we still made it. So that's very cool. We're definitely progressing at a decent pace. We've really been killing it this run. Uh, so let's keep on going. We're gonna keep dodging side to side and we made it. And we're just gonna go ahead and fall it at a controlled pace. Um, but yeah, it is definitely exciting seeing how much progress I'm making. I did not think that this run would be this good. Uh, we are now out of a shield, but even if we lose, it's fine. The, ah, dang. Of course, the second you say that is the second something happens. But yeah, we have enough stuff that we can go ahead and go and grab the third vehicle, which means that the next time we do a Let's Play of this particular game, which very well is probably going to be for Sunday, I will go ahead and have all of that stuff, which is very exciting. I was able to upgrade my ship and do incredibly well, extremely fast in this particular video. So that is very exciting. Let's go ahead and grab the vehicle and then, yeah. Now we're gonna go ahead and shut off the recording as soon as you all get to see the video, or as soon as you all get to see the ship. Have a great day, everyone.